So it's been 46 days now and there is still no sign of Kate Middleton, also known as Princess of Wales. The last time anyone actually saw her walking around uh, was Christmas Day of last year. And since then, it's just been a series of bizarre incidents and uh, conflicting stories from the royal family, from her husband, which leads, which has led to a wild speculations on the internet. Um, despite that, there has been no effort on the part of Kensington Palace to produce some kind of sign of life to assure the public that Kate is in fact okay and still with us. So William stepped out today for uh, official royal duties. Here he is at an investiture ceremony um, where he was awarding MBEs and it was not lost on anyone that his appearance um, was a little bit strange. He appeared to be unwieldy, rocking back and forth. Uh, some people said he looked like he might be drunk. I don't know about that. Um, to me, he, uh, he looks like a man with the weight of the world on his shoulders. He has bags under his eyes. He looks gaunt. He looks, uh, extremely worried. And I think he has very good reason to be. Uh, at one point, he even uh, dropped the, um, the MBE that he was awarding to the recipient. And uh, there she is looking rather bemused. And it just highlights his very strange behavior. Here he is talking about the Filipino nurses that cared for Kate while she was in the hospital. And it just made me think of um, these police dramas where the prime suspect always talks too much. They always give too much information. As if they're trying to overcompensate or cover up for some kind of guilt which leads me to these um, news reports this one is back in 2021 about Williams very violent temper um, where apparently he even fights with his dad his father is even somewhat scared of him and uh, even Camilla said that the boys got quite a temper Here's another one uh, that says that William mistreats Kate verbally and em emotionally. Um, Kate Middleton has been subjected to emotional and verbal abuse by her husband. And this revelation has caused quite a stir among royal insiders. And here's another one about his famous tantrums, that he's prone to tantrums. And, of course, we know about Prince Harry's revelation in his now best-selling memoir about a violent episode where William attacked him. So, there's a possibility that Kate's disappearance could have something to do with William's violent temper. It may not necessarily be physical violence but uh, she could have been driven to harm herself another strong possibility is Kate has been looking dangerously thin for a long time and um, it is possible that one's Organs can begin to fail after prolonged 
uh, eating disorder. Uh, it's pretty obvious to me that she is anorexic um, and bulimic as well. Uh, there are numerous photographs. Here's one here of her um, with bandages on her fingers, which is a sign of bulimia. And I know this because I was bulimic when I was a teenager. And uh, you get bruises on your fingers when you jam them down your throat after you eat. So something could have happened to her as a result of an eating disorder, some kind of catastrophic health crisis as, as a result of a prolonged eating disorder. Anyway, uh, you know, the palace could easily quell all these wild speculations by simply showing some sign of life, you know, assuring the public that Kate is okay, but I have a feeling that they're unable to do that, and that's what's so scary. So drop a line in the comments and tell me what you think. What do you think happened to Kate? Do you think we'll ever see her again?